Once upon a time, in a not so far off land, there lived three triplets, Lena, Myra, and Dave. <laughs> These kids were the best of friends. They all got along very well with each other. They also had one younger sibling named Isaac. After giving birth to him, their mother died, and their father died shortly afterwards. One day, a few years ago, Dane had an idea. What if they made a movie? The other triplets agreed, and they named their company Golden Point Films. At first, their movies weren't that good, but as they made more, they became better and better. One day, they shared a movie that they had made with their grandma. Their grandma thought it was excellent. She showed it to all her friends, and they showed it to all of theirs. Soon, most of the U.S. had heard of Golden Point Films, and of Dane, Myra, and Lena. One day, the CEO of Disney was at their doorstep, asking if he could buy their company for $900 million. All right. <laughs> After talking to their grandparents, they agreed and sold their company. They were some of the richest kids in America. They moved into a nice house and owned a private jet along with many other nice things. One day, their grandparents agreed to let them visit their other pair of grandparents by themselves. However, Isaac was still too young to go, and so the triplets went alone. But it's not very good to go by yourselves. One day when you're older, I bet you'll get to go on a trip. And without us. But I want to go with you guys. Sorry, you're just not old enough. I wish I was born sooner. Well, there's no point in complaining about that, because you can't change it. Besides, we'll have just as much fun here. We will have just as much fun there as you will here. No, I won't. Well, stop complaining. Come on, guys. We better go finish packing. But it's not fair. Life's not fair. Come on. We're going to be late. Bye. Oh. <laughs> Where is it? being bothered by Isaac. <laughs> I know, it'll be so nice. Hopefully he doesn't get into any trouble while we're away. You know him, he'll be in trouble by the time the plane is even in the air. She's right now. Guys right? Yep. Okay, let's go. Triplets soon took off. They had a great week away from home, and then proceeded to fly back. However, on their journey home, they unexpectedly hit a huge thunderstorm. They didn't have enough fuel to turn around, so they had to fly through it. Their plane never made it out. Back home, everyone was shocked. A funeral was held for the triplets. Since they hadn't written wills yet, all of their money went to the grandparents who had raised them. Ten years went by, and their grandparents also passed. Isaac eventually inherited the family fortune, but continued to live in the same house. One day, a strange plane landed on the family's runway. That trip was so fun. Yeah, it was. We should do something like it again sometime. Totally. Well... You? Who are you? And how do you know our names? What are you doing in our house? It can't be. You're, you all are dead. What? Who are you? I'm Isaac, your younger sibling. What? This doesn't make sense. Everyone thought you died. Why would they think that? We've been gone for one week. No, we've been gone ten years. What? Come inside. My chef's making some of his world-famous cookies. We'll talk more later. Right this way. Let's go. Let's go. Come here. Wow, there's a dial on. Come here. Right there, listen.
Well, then tell us everything that's happened since we've left. Okay. So you guys got on your plane, went to North Dakota for the week. <clears throat> and then you got on the plane ride back, but it never made it home. And then eventually, Grandma and Grandpa passed away, and I took over the estate. But why have we aged? Why haven't we aged and you have? And why did it feel like normal time for us? I don't know, it might remain a mystery to us forever. Did our grandparents write wills? Yes, but since everyone thought you died, <laughs> they had them changed, and there's nothing in them about you three. But isn't the money in a state rightfully ours? Sorry, but legally, no. This is so unfair! Someone once told me that life's not fair. I can't believe this! I'm going to my room! I'll go talk to her. <laughs> I guess I'll go get washed up this <clears throat> Shame, man. Are you okay, sis? I'm fine. It's just, I can't believe him! He has our money and he won't give it back? Well, now that he's older than us, he'll pass sooner and we'll inherit the money again. Myra, what is an 85-year-old going to do with the money? I want to use it for other things than yarn to knit with. <coughs> well, what, what would we use it for? We probably just waste it on something stupid. <clears throat> more wisely when we're older. What if, what if we were older when the Isaac's wills were read? What if something accidentally happened to him? Lena, no! He's our brother. It don't be reasonable either. I already told you, we'll work something out. Oh yes, we will. Does anyone know where we keep the spare poison? Thane, can I talk to you? Yeah. <laughs> Well, it hasn't moved in the past 10 years. It's it's <laughs> Obviously, something on the plane has made Lena go mad. Yes, it appears so. I'm going to tell Isaac what's, what Lena's plotting. Well, what if she overhears you telling her? Yeah. It's just a risk I'm going to have to take. Hey, just be careful. <laughs> What is it? Lena's trying to poison you. No, she wouldn't do that. I'm just saying, watch your back. Okay, thanks, Myra. I gotta go before Lena starts looking for me. Yeah. <laughs> One, two, three. That should be enough to shut him down. <laughs> Why are you crying? Sorry, that did not mean to come out like that. Well, Dave said my hair is messy, so I started crying. No reason to cry. Now that you say that, it does sound silly. It's time for dinner. Why are you crying? I thought he was yelling at me. Something weird is going on here. I know, wait. <laughs> I had my chef prepare something special for your return. Chef! I give you peas or green beans. <laughs> green beans? I know what you're thinking. Why green beans? Well, Ever since you guys disappeared, there's a national green bean shortage, and they're extremely difficult to get. What is it? Oh, I was just thinking of how many peas they must have killed to make this green bean dish. Why are you crying about that? I don't know. Well, 
Let's have a toast to your guys' return. Okay. Alina, Dane, and Myra. Is this water? Chef knows I would. Nope. Chef! <laughs> Please take this away. Yes, sir. You can't make a toast and not drink the drink! Why are you <laughs> shouting? I don't know. Wait a minute. Why do you think Lena is so loud and angry and Myra is so sad? It must be because the plane did something with their emotions. But that means... I would be... Hi guys, it's a beautiful day out. Yeah? I told you to rain me. Oh, well then it would be great for all the plants. <laughs> These peas are so good. Stop being so cheerful and stop crying! Hey, you're killing it, is it me? But it's so good. <laughs> stop being so cheerful and stop crying! Stop! What just happened? I don't know. Maybe it was something with the plane. Or the green beans. Well, now that Dane has eaten my entire supply of green beans for the year, I'm gonna retire to my room for the night. Good night. Good night, everyone. Let's go to my room and talk about what just happened. Your head. 